Okay, so today we're talking about how to store Brussels sprouts. One thing that's really important when you bring Brussels sprouts home is if there's any leaves that are wilting or yellow or starting to mold, you definitely wanna remove those before you put them in the fridge. So the thing about Brussels sprouts too is once you get them home, if you store them properly, they'll last for weeks. Heck, they can almost last for a month, but Brussels sprouts are best when they're eaten close to after they're harvested. So after you buy them, I recommend eating them within a few days because they're just gonna lose that sweetness and get bitter and more bitter over time. And if you've ever had bad Brussels sprouts, that's probably why. So if you have the loose Brussels sprouts, the thing you wanna do with those is you wanna put them in a plastic bag or any sort of storage bag and put them in the crisper drawer of your fridge. That will actually protect them the most and keep them really fresh for about a week. Now, the best way to buy a Brussels sprouts is if you can buy them on the stock. They'll actually last longer on the stock and the way that you store them is you take that stock and you want to store it like cut flowers. So take the stock, trim off the end, put it in some water, put that in the fridge. That's actually the best way to store Brussels sprouts and actually keep fresh for a really long time. So one thing that's really important is to not wash your produce or wash the Brussels sprouts before you put them in the fridge. The reason for that is moisture is bad. It's the enemy when it comes to food in your refrigerator. Now I know when you're at the supermarket, you see all the produce being sprayed and you're like, hey, they're spraying it there. Why does it matter if it's different at home? The reason is all the produce is nice and open, right? So it's all there and open so that water has the opportunity to evaporate. In the fridge, it doesn't. So it's just there and it then becomes the enemy of your produce. So don't wash things before you put them in the fridge. Wash them when you're about to use them. So as I mentioned, Brussels sprouts on the stock is the best way to get them, right? They're gonna last the longest that way. And you just wanna pull them off the stock when you're ready to use them. But if you are meal prepping, because hey, we're all busy and that saves you time, if you're meal prepping and you're chopping up some Brussels sprouts, store them in an airtight container, keep them in the fridge, but you're gonna to wanna to use them within about three or four days. And lastly, if they have spoiled, like they smell bad and not just cause you don't like them. If they smell bad or they're black or they're kind of squishy, just toss them out. Don't eat those Brussels sprouts. So here's another thing about Brussels sprouts. They're very sensitive to ethylene gas. All produce puts off some level of ethylene gas. And the thing is ethylene gas causes things to ripen at different speeds. So apples and pears put off a lot of ethylene gas. So if you store your Brussels sprouts next to them, they're gonna spoil and rotten faster. So don't store your Brussels sprouts next to the apples or pears. So you wanna keep them in a separate area away from things that produce a lot of ethylene gas like apples or pears. If you like this video, hey, give me a thumbs up. If there's something you wanna see, drop a comment down below. And if you like to cook like I do, I release new videos every single week, so please subscribe. Thank you.